Hey, what's going on, players? One and two of every age. Uh, Spider Nerd signing in once again. Uh, so, uh, um, if you're just joining me, pretty much I just got out of work. So, we're going to go ahead and hop right into the Legends Assemble four week event that I announced during my uh, post uh, um, Monsters Unleashed review from last night. Um, for those of you guys who saw it, uh, I definitely want to know in the comments below what you thought. It ran about a half an hour. Not something that I usually do myself, but kind of want to know uh, what you guys thought, uh, um, your thoughts. I mean, like I said, it ran a half an hour. Uh, I can definitely do shorter. I just had a lot of information to go through. Um, so while I'm waiting for the game to load, <clears throat> here we go. Anybody else need a nap? Yes, yes, yes. Game load just a little bit faster. Here we go. All right, so Aim and Hydra have joined forces with Atuma, leader of the Underworld Acad or Underwater Academy. The villainous schools captured Avengers Academy faculty, crashed tidal waves onto the school, and docked their battleships at the campus. The Avengers must free their uh, their mentors to defeat the villainous uh, coalition to restore order to the Avengers Academy. Yes, I would like to start the event. I'm searching for the world's greatest heel breaker. Come on, catch up. I know you want to. There we go. Oh, I'm already liking this. So, big wide shot of the um, event um, area here. Um, I love it already. So, you definitely have a World War II vibe with his uh, Atuma's minions here. So, I love that. Looks like there's a nice little dinner table there. Um, there's Hank Pym. Hank Pym, get Avengers Academy's resident mad scientist. Remember, science! And unlock all new animations uh, and quests. Uh, Hank Pym battles uh, Lumerian soldiers, prompts rock salt blasters to appear on the, on the event mission board, and uses the power of scientific enthusiasm uh, to fight multiple combat types. So, these are the Lumerian soldiers that we just saw. These are the uh, salt blasters, as well as he's powerful against poisonous foes, which is great. That's because as, as the, on the upper right hand, excuse me, left hand side, you can see that radioactive symbol there. And we get Nick Fury, who looks like he actually might be playable, which is great. And he's sporting the Infinity Gauntlet. Come on. Then we have Odin right here. Love that guy. I, I love how they decided to give him a new skin already. Um, and as you can see here, we have Elsa from Frozen. I mean, Frigga, uh, who is Thor's mother. So it looks like um, these are all going to be unlockable types here. And it's a little... Oh, wow, Jarvis? Okay, so those of you who are familiar uh, with the Iron Man world... There were a lot of different versions of Jarvis. Jarvis used to be um, Tony Stark's butler, like a physical butler, um, almost like Alfred from Batman, um, who was basically just as engine, uh, um, not as, as much of a genius, but he still understood what uh, Tony was doing when he did it. Then we get the computerized version. Um, so if you guys could ignore that, that'd be great. Um, um, <clears throat> that's one thing I hate about recording on a smart device is that I have messenger on here and every once in a while, a really random message will appear severely random. Uh, but that is my friend, Vanessa. <laughs> um, so there was a computerized version that we know from the movies that we know from the newer generation comics, that kind of thing. Um, so it looks like he's going to be a great asset, as well as the Atumas, 
a battleship that basically can or cannot be a kraken slash uh, um, whale. Definitely enjoying the whole scenery there. Really cool. Pulled out all the stops pretty much. Doing a quick last minute scan. It doesn't look like much else is here. Alright, so I just basically before doing the event, um, I was finishing off the Mordo uh, quest line here. Um, so I need uh, forbidden text on my next on my dark magic. There are a bunch of uh, there are a bunch in the basement of the, of the archive. Really? Yeah, Odin brought stacks of dark magic books with him when he when he op when we opened. But I asked him to uh, keep them in the basement before they give me the heebie-jeebies. I never thought I'd hear Dick Fury say heebie-jeebies. I have feelings. I'm allowed to get heebie-jeebies. Here we go. This is what I wanted to go into. You and your undersea university will attack first, Atuma. Arnim Zola and Hydra School will strike second. And the AIM Institution 2.0 will eradicate the remaining survivors. Atuma does not take orders from dirt walkers. My tidal waves will cripple the academy. My undersea legions will capple, capture the faculty, and their cosmic treasure will be mine. We agree to share the treasure. We agreed to, uh, that getting my revenge against Modok and the Avengers was a primary objective. We changed our minds, dark skin, dry skin. My skin is supremely moist. <laughs> moist. So this game basically was ready to go early in the morning, around 8 o'clock, if not sooner than that. Unfortunately, with the way my work schedule is, it ain't going to happen. Um, so I'm going to go ahead and go through the tutorial pretty quick. Um, those of you who just started getting into the Avengers Academy with the Monsters Unleashed event, or uh, um, just downloaded the game now, um, I'll try to uh, explain as best I can. If you do want a little bit more information, let me know in the comments below, but I'm going to try to go through it quick. So as always, you got a quick intro to the Legends, as Legends Assemble. <clears throat> um, you get a brief synopsis on how to fight villains with the event schedule. Um, you get to earn rock salts uh, during the missions. You get to collect solar grenades uh, from the Lumerians you fight to get a Tuma. And then, of course, with the secret missions uh, um, from the Helicarrier, um, you get these secret codes. And this is basically like every other game that has been out involving just basic battle types. Uh, your strong is stronger than poison. Um... Your poison is stronger than fast characters, and then vice versa. So your uh, looks like your fast characters. Um, it's gonna be a whole circle. I don't know why they had it like this at the very bottom, when they clearly have a diagram going where strong is, uh, strong. The strength is stronger than fast or speed. Speed is stronger than poison. Poison is stronger than strength. It's kind of confusing, but I'm not too. I'm not too big. Uh, uh, excuse me. I'm not too upset. Well, I'll learn as we go. Let's get serious. Or not. So we're going to go ahead and send a few guys on Trident mission before we hop in. Actually, you know what? Why don't I do what I always do and get the uh, quest line uh, going first with tutorials. And then we'll hop into uh, mission boards uh, after the video. <clears throat> All right, so more M Mordo stuff here. Just kind of want to get them off the board. All right, he is off. So right now, it actually looks like it's going to be a um, 
brief tutorial. It's not like the Monsters Unleashed where it was going to be a big tutorial. So I'm going to go ahead and uh, call it a video, have all of my students um, do the um, Trident quests to get these Tridents, uh, um, which would is our for, uh, version of monetary value, like the uh, Space Herbs uh, from last uh, quest, uh, excuse me, from the last event from Monsters Unleashed. Um, but I'm going to go ahead and call it a video. Enjoy the rest of your weekend, guys. Um, if you're here in, in New England, I hope the weather isn't treating you too badly. But uh, stay warm, or <laughs> uh, depending on where you live, stay cool. But uh, this will be Spider Nerd. Uh, peace, uh, signing out. Peace.